hilarious bond. We just thought we were so funny and we really just didn't have a town. I haven't seen that one. We started a little trio a cappella group. I haven't seen that one either. We performed at our spring concert and um, someone filmed it and put it on YouTube and that was our first experience. Well, I've seen that one. Duality. We were like, maybe this actually could be something. <laughs> and I think that's why Scott was so inspired to do the same. So I joined an acapella group in college and a lot of them have been on the sing off before, so they're like, you should try out. Scott contacted us and he was like, hey, oh, she looks beautiful. Have you ever heard of the show called The Sing Off? And I actually had, when Scott approached me about the audition for The Sing Off, I was a little a little wary because it was something that was totally outside of my comfort zone. I mean, just leaving Arlington, Texas alone was really scary to me. But, you know, I had big dreams and I didn't really want to waste this opportunity. I thought it could be really something special. I met Ben Graham in SoCal Hotels. When I was putting the group together, I knew I wanted him involved. So I saw that video of them on the telephone before I even met Scott. I was already thinking about, like, he should definitely audition for the sing-off. So I talked to him about the group. He was like, man, you need a bass and a beatboxer. And I already have the bass for you. His name's Bobby Kaplan. So, ben hey, Graham, buddy. We just happened to go to the same rehearsal. Ended up singing together a little bit. And so he sent me the video of the trio. And, uh, so crazy because my friend had just showed me that video like like three or four months ago and I was like oh those kids are amazing like I would love to sing with them they're so talented I love their style and he sent me this video and I'm like yes absolutely let's do it and then I went to Oregon my friends engaged me and they showed me this video of this guy beatboxing and playing cello and it was Kevin it's almost like it was meant to be yeah it's like this had to happen I called him up it was destiny right here not like, that I really believe in that sort of thing. Said, hey, we just saw your video, and listen, we're trying to create a group for this TV show called The Sing Off. So I said, okay, sure. And it was one of the best decisions I've ever made in my life. I was like a poor college student, so I spent all the money I had to fly Kevin out for this audition. I split it with um, Ben Graham, and um, ended up being the best investment in my entire life. True. I think we were all uncertain to how it would all come together. It was so many... It was completely different people, completely different places, and in different walks of their life. So we were like, oh man, I really hope that everyone gets along this really clicks because it could be a total disaster. The six of us met up the day before the audition. And we sang for the first time, we sang telephone. And it was just so magical. That sounds maybe cliche, but it was such a moment that it was like fate had brought us together and, and, and in that song, I think we really started to believe in our potential. I, I, I just knew that we could do it. I knew that we could be something special. And we Shit. Did it. And we did. I have not seen that. <laughs> I don't, no, I haven't. That's pretty bad. Thank you guys so much. Absolutely. Now we don't tell you guys this story just to talk about it. We tell you guys because we genuinely just want to thank you so much for all that you guys have done for us this would not be possible without you guys so thank you guys so much truly celebrations and i'd be so happy if i was them well, I actually doing it. It's sick. This is still the first show, isn't it? Man, I feel so proud right now. Proud parrot. Like a total acapella snob who hates everything if they came one day and thought he could change. Yes. Okay. Totally. <laughs> Every moment that he was doing so good, we would, we, you would do it and it would be like, yes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Daddy, send it to I miss you. I miss you too. Where you I can't go 30 seconds without you by my side. Hold me. Oh, these guys. <laughs> yes. Thank you. Get around. I'm just playing. Oh. You rock on my mind. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for skating. Oh. <laughs> Everyone tells us that. I know. I know. You're right. Oh my god, he's right. Super, it's fine. The 10th one today. It's super weird. Hello. <laughs> <
Yeah, look at that pose, Joe. I've been seeing those pop up on my Twitter feed. I think Travis thought this was his, but he is. Yeah, he is. That'll be so dope though, just to experience that once in a lifetime. It's like every artist's dream. Well, for us, our instrument is our body, so when we get sick, we can't do the show to our fullest potential. Sure. We don't have any tracks or anything behind us to back us up, and so when one of us gets sick, the show really, really suffers. And so that is nerve wracking and tough. And then somehow, always sick, and it's really sad. I think it made me a little bit more professional and being like, I have to be well because I want to do my job and I want to kill it. She's still happy and, though. Um, Look at her. That's kind of the mentality that I took over. Well, I feel like, you know that like warm city guy that's in my head? Mm -hmm. I feel that too. So it's not just like, I'm going to get out because it sucks. It right. just makes me feel bad. I <laughs> see <laughs> Fire up, man. I never get over the talent, eh? Hey. Oh my gosh, and she made this video announcing the tour, and a majority of the video she's just talking about how much she loves us. It was so really nice. All she had to say was, I'm going to throw my time. I know she likes my time. She wanted to be like, I want to be Because she's an angel. She's an angel. She's an angel. Utah Jazz. The Sarah Mubal or States in America. Basketball teams. I want to see Kirsten's reaction um, right now. That's beautiful. <laughs> oh man. You can hear Kevin's laugh. What's going on? Um, I have fun. I assume like Rex will have to us too tomorrow. But I will Kirsten Maldonado oh, laughing yeah. video. To get through the night. <laughs> That's all that matters. Uh, <laughs> you guys are nice. Okay, so this is the first tour that we've ever performed this next song. Um, but it's it? one of the first songs we ever recorded. It's called Love You Long Term. And he did one. Okay, good, you know. Alright, we love performing this. We hope you guys enjoy. Here we go. Nobody ever loved me. You love me like a real girl. She loves me and mine. And you know I'm a man who's gonna take my spot. And I, I'm so happy. Thank you. 
That's so cool, man. They actually take the time to do this sort of thing. Jesus. <laughs> I noticed that there's a lot of artists, man, amongst the pentaholics. Like, really good. Look at that. That's beautiful. Nothing to have luck. Alright, I'll see you guys in the middle court. <laughs> Working on the album on tour. That's sick. That it is easy. Okay, we know exactly what we have to do, right? Oh my god, it's so dope. Because in the past, usually, you just focus on the show. But this one pretty much always worked. Tomorrow we want to start on this song called Rose Gold. That so wow. recording it? Yeah, uh, no. Uh, I think the toughest thing about I doing I really want to see a music video for that song. Is it's my favorite song on the album. Played on the radio for it, and the radio like requires kind of a specific sound to play a song, and so crafting an arrangement that could play on the radio but holding the integrity of acapella sure. is, has been a task. And as you're getting ready to release. An album of mostly originals. What sort of things do you think about? We have a really cool system because we're all so different. If it can get past all five of us, I feel like a lot of people are going to like it. Because if it gets past all five of us, it's going to be the best possible product because we're all super picky for different reasons. Yeah. A priority for us has been to not lose integrity to the two because it's just so easy for people to be like, well, why don't you add this? If you just add piano, blah, 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 if you add this, like it'll change so much on the game. And it's like, no, what brought us so far and what people love about us is the fact that it is. Gotta let you know where I come from. I gotta hold down the city. city.